Good morning, everyone. How are you doing this wonderful Friday? It's absolutely beautiful out. If you notice, today, half my face looks decent, and the other half of my face does not look decent. Well, mainly like my eyes. So, last night, I was told that I was double dog dared by a little Miss Tiffany to do a makeup tutorial. And I instantly was like, double dog dared. So my elementary school kid inside of me was like, yes, do it. And I was like, I'm going to do it, but I'm going to be nervous about it because I'm not a makeup person. Well, I love makeup. I love, love, love makeup. Don't get me wrong. Um, but I'm not one that people are like, oh, I like your makeup. Like, like how I am with Tiffany. I just like her and Danielle. I am always like, ah, oh, your makeup beautiful I want to be just like you please teach me your ways you know like I just the, their makeup is just amazing so having one of them be like hey do a makeup tutorial I was like oh great <laughs> so but I can't resist a challenge I gotta make my people happy so that's what I decided to do and then I was like wait a second normally my extra filming days are for Disney weeklies and I was like wait a second Halloween's tomorrow and a lot of people did say on Sunday whenever we had our spectacular event that they really liked my makeup. So I was like, I'll just do what I did then. Now, so as you can see, I've already done half my face. And if I done half my face, I mean, I did already wash it and moisturize it. And if you want to know what type of moisturizer I use, it was a Shea Moisture. And you, if you watched yesterday's video, you would know that this was on my favorites. If you didn't watch that video, go watch it. And then I also use my coverall by Wet n Wild in medium. And then I use my, this is new to me. By new, I mean like I've only had it for like a week and a half or so. The NYC Smooth Skin 5-in-1 Instant Matte Skin Perfector. And this is also in medium. I think in that case though, if they had like a darker color, I probably would have gone with it. And then I also... I'll get to the makeup part in just a second. But that's skin prepping for my face. So pretty much we're going to be using this beautiful Urban Decay. Actually, you're going to see a lot of Urban Decay products. Actually, mainly, that's what you're going to see. I also have curled my eyelashes. And I did not put mascara on on this eye yet. But you'll see. Now, the biggest difference is but that you're going to see between the two eyes is is that this eye right here is going to have the Urban Decay Eyelid Primer. And this is just the basic, it's the original one. The other ones have like, a few of them have shimmers in them. And because of my electric palette, I, I couldn't have that. So, I mean, because sometimes you can wear like that one just by itself. So, let me go ahead and get right in here with this. I'm just going to squeeze a little bit of this out on my finger. That was probably way too much, but it's okay. Because at this point, even if I get some underneath my eye, it won't matter. And it couldn't hurt it at all. Because this stuff is amazing. Just a little tiny bit goes a long, long way. And the reason why this electric palette is like my go-to palette is because of all the really bright colors. I mean... I know it's a little bit dirty, but we're going to be using this color right here called Slow Burn, which is a reddish orangish color. Now, I did not put the eyelid primer on this one, which is why I was like, originally, like I've already filmed this once. So I was like, oh no, I forgot it. So I wanted to take that off so that way you guys can see the difference because this is very not like what I am. Um, look like the other day but first I'm going to use my my eyeliner really quick here and eyeliner is new to me too like I don't normally use any a lot of this stuff like having contacts now I'm like I have to pay attention to what I look like you know I can't just hide behind my glasses so this is NYC City Proof 24 hour waterproof eyeliner pencil this is in dark brown and here it is and I'm just gonna go ahead and get in here I wonder how many of you guys, your eyelids just like sit here and twitch and you're, you're like, stop twitching. Now, 
If I had a regular mirror that was like sitting right here, I'd be like holding it so that way it would do the bottom, or that way that I could just grab a hold of it. Okay, and then I'm going to do under here. And then I'm just going to bring this out a little bit. Just a little. Ooh, gotta fix that little bit there. All right, just bringing it out. Wow. It's so weird looking at like me with eyeliner. I'm still not used to that. Okay. Now, if you before you're like, Lisa, you didn't go all the way in your eye. Ah, no. There's a reason for that. Okay. So, get rid of that. All right. Now, the brush that comes with this, I always like to use this little end here. And as you can see, it's already pretty. <laughs> I've used it a lot. All right. So, I'm just going to go ahead and get in there. And normally, this is how close I would keep it. But I'm like, I have contacts now. I don't have to hold it that close. I try to pick a starting point, which is normally where my eyeliner is. And then with this stuff, you have to dab it. Otherwise, it's going to not look right. And you're not going to get really, really good color. My eyes are twitching like crazy. Can you guys see that? It is like twitching like crazy. Okay, now here's the fun part. That's whenever I... See, look. Boom! Instant. And all I did was just take it and then just kind of flicked it up a little bit. Now, I really want this to be bold. So I'm going to layer it. That's the one thing that I really, 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 really love about Urban Decay makeup. You can layer it and layer it and layer it and layer it. And it, the more that you put on, the better off you are. I mean, the more intense and everything. Like, you could do a super little light sweep of it. Now, you're probably like, Lisa, your eyeliner pretty much disappeared. It did, but you'll see something here in just a little bit, what I'm going to do. Okay, I'm going to bring this up a little bit further than the other one. Okay, and, okay. So I know you're like, that doesn't look right. Give me a second. Let me fix it. <laughs> Actually, I'm not fixing it because, honestly, I'm now done with the electric palette. Because now I'm going to be moving on to my Naked 2 palette. And I really, at first I was like, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. And... I have been using this like crazy lately. Okay, so I like using the gold colors, particularly this half-baked color that's right here. And this is, I love using the fluffy brush on this on this one. It comes with the little flat brush like that. As you can see, I used it for my purple. Um, but I'm just gonna use the half-baked and I'm just gonna go in here and bring that right on up to my eyelid. My brow bone and then I'm also going to go in here because I like that extra little pop right there okay kind of see look man the lighting in here right now is not doing me justice okay so that's that okay now one thing that I am going to do is I'm going to take probably this this color right here it's called busted um, it's not the black but it is the busted. And I'm just going to use the little part here. Just kind of get just a little bit on it. And I'm going to go back, right back over that eyeliner. Since it was a brown. Okay. And then do a little bit of that flick. Now, for this, I'm just going to kind of brush this out just a little bit. Just a little bit. And I'm actually going to go ahead and bring this over just a little bit more just to kind of extend it just a little bit. Okay, now I'm going to need that mirror still. Now for the part that I'm still not used to, and that is my eyebrows. I bought this um, at the Super Target. We do carry it at my Target, but that's not where I bought it at. This is the New York, the NYC Browser Brush on Brow Kit in Brunette. I figure that's the closest to my eye color, or my eye, my hair. So, it comes with, like, this waxy stuff right here, and this really nifty little brush. So, what I'm guessing you do is you put the wax on first, and um, just kind of brush it in. I mean, I'm I'm just guessing at this, y'all. 
because it didn't come with any directions. Like it really, really didn't. Okay, and then you take, I'm guessing the same brush because it didn't come with any other brushes and then use that. Just kind of like dab it on in here. Let's see if this actually works. And then you, ah, I see color, okay, cool. Okay, it doesn't look terrible. I mean, I've seen my eyebrows look a lot worse. I don't know what in the world is going on with these couple hairs here. Let's see what's going on here. Do I have a couple hairs that are just like, oh, hey, like all grouped together? I don't know. What's up with that? You know what, though? They've always been like that for as long as I can remember. Like, it's always that one group of hairs. Okay, so there's that. All right, so... That's pretty much the eye itself is done, except for I need mascara. Yay! Okay, so I'm going to be using my Maybelline Lash Sensational, which this stuff can get kind of clumpy. So you might want to be careful with that. Um, all right, I'm trying to do this quickly because I don't want this video to be too long here. I mean, I'm already at almost 12 minutes, so... Man, it takes a lot of coat sometimes, and I don't know why. I did curl my eyelashes, by the way. I don't know if I told you guys that or not, but I did curl them. Okay, that's good enough <laughs> for me not going anywhere. All right, then bottom lashes. Bottom lashes. <laughs> okay, now... For the part that I don't necessarily care for. Um, I am using NYC Smooth Skin Loose Face Powder in Natural Beige. I hate using powder. I mean, like, whenever I say I hate using it, I mean, like, loose powder scares me. Because you're going to see it all over the place. Alright, and I have my Wet n Wild brush. I don't recommend anybody get this Wet n Wild Kabuki brush. You can see, look at all the hairs that are just falling out of it. All right. Normally, I would put my mascara on after. Ugh. And then it gets everywhere. And, oh, it's just not pretty. And watch, guys. Watch. That is disgusting. I don't like it. Okay. And then, for my last thing, because what look is not complete without some lip gloss. Uh-huh. Go ahead and... Ooh, girl. This is why I need a mirror over here. I need a mirror. Mm -hmm. All right. This, uh, I'll show you what this is in just a second. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. There I go. All right. Now, I normally don't wear blush. I have enough rosiness, I don't need blush. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and pick you guys up. Oh, oh, by the way, that was, where to go? This was Elf, and in this is in the color Michael. It doesn't say what number, uh, it does, but it's a long number. Okay, so let me see if I can stand up here for just a second and bring you guys over to where I'm a little bit more in the light. Okay, I don't want to be directly in the light. Good Lord, that would be terrible. All right, so here's some different... Oh, that's better. Okay, now you guys might be able to see. Oh, no, you can't see anything. Okay, there we go. Okay, so this is with the eyelid primer, and this is without the eyelid primer. Look at how much bolder this one is compared to this one. Also, I do a lot better job on my right eye than my left eye. But you can clearly see that this one is a lot better. So... There you go. Tiffany, I hope you approve because <laughs> I did this just for you. I'm not even going anywhere. Matter of fact, I'm probably going to be sweating most of this off in a matter of like the next few minutes. <laughs> so there you go. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Sorry this video is so long. I'm sorry. Man, I should like take some profile pictures. I look good today. Mm -hmm. Not really. But okay. <laughs> I've got to stop insulting myself. That's something that I'm working on. I have to stop doing that. 
All right, guys. So hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. I will see you guys back next Tuesday. Bye.